All right. Well, uh, here's my little perspective on some of the things that uh, went on last night. I uh, checked out the UDFL game uh, over at Whittier College, I believe. As y'all see, I'm just now getting up, man. And I'm over here looking on the computer screen, just responded to scales, um, posts, and things like that. Um, shit, I got a whole office full of people out there that I need to go out there and handle. But I just kind of want to um, just say, you know, I apologize for going hard on uh, Ram last night. You know, I just kind of got a little emotional and things because uh, the issues with the whole UDFL uh, not allowing a lot of my fellow Cowboy players who deserve to play until the end, um, the UDFL just, you know, the, the issues that have happened with the league, uh, the mess that's been made of all of that. It's just ridiculous. It's a black eye um, to the game of football or semi-pro uh, as a whole. So me being the veteran that I am, you know, going to support my boys, uh, took a look on the LCFL uh, Facebook page. And uh, with that, I uh, saw that Ram had, uh, you know, put up his you know opinion on what was going on. And I took that opportunity and I wanted to interview him to find out why he utilized the word fear as it was in as is as if it was in reference to a team or a league per se, uh, being scared to play one of those people. Uh, I know that that's not the case. And I what I don't know is why they can't play. So him being in the journalist capacity, he should be capable of, uh, let's just say, uh, uh, capable of getting those answers because he is the one person that can go outside of the league parameters and talk to the higher powers in each league and provide us the answers as to why it doesn't work, why can't they play. So, you know, I'm not going to make this a big old long thing about it, but I'm publicly going on record saying, Ram, I do apologize for my, you know, addressing you in that matter. However, what I'm not going to apologize for is asking you the question, why can't they play? Why can't they play? And maybe you can take this as motivation or a little fire in your ass to go and uh, get it together. Go ahead, man. Find that answer. Put it out there for us. You know, breaking news, all of that. You know, and let's make this happen. You know, and on another note, um, well, I'm not going to go there. I'm going to just leave this, uh, this topic up. But, you know, congratulations to my cowboy partners. You put in work. You did what you needed to do despite all the hostility and all the bullshit that you guys have had to endure. You still was able to produce a viable product, put it out there on the field, and make some shit happen. And, therefore, you got it from me. I'm your boy, Rock. Uh, to everybody out there that's uh, commenting, uh, Curtis Perkins, Leon Williams, my man Scales, um, you know, a few other folks that's out there putting it out there. Just know it's not a personal assault on the guy. I'm a stand-up type guy, as you guys know. I do what I do on the field, off the field. I make a lot of moves, and I'm trying to make the product of semi-pro football viable also because I've got some bigger folks that's looking at this from a different angle. And if you don't know, then maybe you need to get in there and read some of my emails and find out what's happening. But there's some big things coming down the pipe. We need to get these things addressed first or I'm going to be looking bad and that's not going to happen. So this is your boy Rock. I'm out.